What is up, guys? Welcome back to a brand new video. Today, we're playing some more Finite Champion. Today, Max Gun is taking on the hardest puncher in the heavyweight division, Mike Tyson v Max Gun. This is going to be an absolute war. 12 rounder for the heavyweight title. Let's see how it goes, man. I cannot wait for this one. Change the gear for Max Gun a little bit here. Let's see how this goes, man. Let's see how this one goes. Beating Tommy Morrison. A few episodes ago, a very good top contender. Now we're going to see... Oh, oh, big shot there for Tyson. Good body shot. We're going to toe-and-toe -toe this uh, this fight. We're going to go toe-to-toe -to -toe with Mike Tyson. And already teeing off Iron Mike. What a fight this will be. Oh, oh, Max Gun stamina though. Let's go. Need to keep an eye on that. Okay. Okay. So I believe if we box Tyson, we might be good. Dude, this is such an interesting fight. Big uppercut there from Iron Mike. As both men push forward. Max Gun walking forward now. Throwing bombs. Oh, big shot for oh, big shot from Dyson. Max Gun lands flush again and again. Here we go, man. Swinging and missing, these boys. Here we go. Big shot to the body. Big shot upstairs. But Max Gun rolls one and throws one back. Big uppercut. Oh! <laughs> the smoke show. Let's go. Good start to the fight for both men. I believe there is a cut over the eye of Max Gun already opened up from Iron Mike. Yeah, that's a bad cut too. Big left. Nice overhand there. Cracks Mike. These guys are just brawling so far. Stamina out the window. Both. Oh, big combination by Tyson. Now, this is a step up. I mean, I mean, Tommy Morrison is a legend. But Mike Tyson, look at that cut. That is a bad cut for Max Gunn. Let's go again. Round two. I don't know who won that first round, man. That was close. Very, very close. Nice uppercut. Good straight. Left hook is landing flush a lot of times. That's something we've got to kind of kind of see and uh, try and mix that into our arsenal a little bit more there. Good shot from Max Gunn. But Tyson is teeing off here, man. He is landing at will. And he is breaking down Max Gunn. We haven't had no one push forward and be this aggressive to Mad Max. Now we're about to see what happens when you do. Good straight. Good straight. Good left hand there. And another one for good measure. These boys are trading. Beautiful strike there. That was a really nice strike for Max Gunn. We've got to keep our wits about us though. Mike Tyson is one of the most ferocious fighters in this division. We need to lead with our jab. Make him miss a little bit. We need to do another Tommy Morrison here where we make him miss. We we'll try and stop him late. Oh, oh, he's ripping us. Oh, big shots from Tyson. This has been a dog fight, bro. What a fight. Big shots for both men. Tyson's doing a real good job of hitting the body of Max Gun. And it's slowing him down. Nice uppercut there for Max. And he's out of the way for these shots. Kind of slip with the jab there. Trying to hit him back to the body there. Oh, oh! The chin on Max Gun. The chin on Max. Never been down at all in his career. And this dude, oh, that cut though. That cut is bad. That cut is definitely bad for Max Gun. Gonna keep it coming. Good straight. Must check left hook there on the inside too. Okay. Tyson just wants to walk forward and freaking destroy, man. Throwing these shots with bad intentions, bro. He is looking to try and destroy Max Gun. Max Gun, though, holding his own in there. Which is something I, I, I thought was going to happen, but... 
Need to be landing these shots though, man. Stamina wise, not good. Why is Tyson backing up? You never see Tyson back up. Why is he backing up? Is he hurt? I don't think so. Boy, they are going at it. In the middle of the ring. Oh, big shot. Cross a jab to the body there. Oh! This is a close fight. I think we need to pace ourselves. Look at the rounds and look at my stamina. We've just been brawling with him. I thought maybe we could fight fire with fire and knock this man down, but that doesn't look like it's happening. I thought maybe if we just stay in there and we just eat his best shots and throw ours back, we might be able to knock him out, but now I'm starting to think that ain't happening at all, man. Jeez. Max Gun doing what Max Gun does, man. You know, using his power, using his ability. And uh, I mean, at the minute, it hasn't paid off. You know, usually most guys that he's landed these shots on, they would be out right now. But Tyson is not most guys. Push down to the body. Beautiful little shot on the inside there. I'm going to try and just box him for a few rounds just to get my stamina back. Oh! Both these guys, they're giving it their all. Big shot to the body for Tyson. And Max Gunn's face is a mess. That is not good. It's 29-28. Tyson's took a round. And it is the constant pressure that is a problem. Max Gunn's struggling here. And he's, he's having to brawl to maintain momentum. And that is a big problem in this fight. I'm going to let him hold on. We need the stamina. Oh, actually, he's low. Come here. <laughs> Damn it, man. That would have been nice. Oh, oh, that was close. Oh! Good shot for Max Gunn, and Tyson hits the canvas early. Big straight right for Mad Max. We needed that. We needed that so bad. Tyson was all over us, man. His stamina was low. And Max Gunn is one of them boys, man. You can't afford to have your stamina low. Okay, you're getting tagged there. Good shot. Ripping the body. I'm hoping that the floodgates are open now and Tyson will go down again, but you never know in this one, man. Dude, this has been a crazy fight so far. Oh! Again, the shots from Max Gunn and again the shots from Tyson. Max Gunn just throwing at him, man. Trying to hurt him again, but Tyson's doing a real good job of covering up here. Big counter shot there for Mike. What a fight. A rematch is in order, no matter how this fight goes and plays out. A rematch is definitely in order. Oh, another counter shot from Mike. Nice shot to the body there for Tyson as well. Max Gunn looking wobbly. Ripped the body there, that was nice. Dude, what a fight. Oh, big right hand there for Gun. Really trying to stick with that jab, you know? I'm trying to slip that man. I, I don't know what it is. Tyson, oh, he's got a cut too now. Let's go. Let's go. That's what we want to see. Stamina wise, it is not looking good for Mad Max. It is not looking good. Tyson got actually, he's got more than him now. But we won that last round, man. We knocked him down, so... Good jab. Gonna use our range a little bit. Tyson does such a good job of pressuring, though, man. Mad Max has got this reach for a reason. We might as well try and use it, right? Does such a good job. Oh, big shot from Iron Mike. And again. Nice left. Okay, we're gonna hold. We need the stamina. We're gonna hold. What a dogfight this has been, bro. Nice right hand there from Max Gunn. But Tyson's still in it. Ripped into the body. We've hit him with our best shots, too. And this guy has just kept coming. I know we dropped him once, but... Dude. Trying to... There we go. Oh, oh. Stamina-wise, I'm trying to watch his stamina and evade punches at the same time. So I'm just trying to crack him. 
dude. What a fight. Max Gunmo. Maybe he's met his match. Oh! Okay. What a fight, man. Both of these guys giving it their all, but look at the stamina on both of them. They're going to be exhausted by the time round 12 gets here. Good jab. Mad Max is cut. He's busted open. He's bruised. He's battered. And he's still pushing on. Oh. And Tyson lands again. Nice straight there for Max Gunn. Nice counter. That was nice. Let's go to the body a little bit more, man. That's something we need to do. Try and open him up a little bit. Max Gunn's face is a mess. Let's keep going. Round six, halfway through the fight. Let's see how this goes. And I'm looking now, we can kind of see that both of these guys have slowed down. We see at the beginning of the fight, they were throwing leather for days. Even Tyson now isn't throwing as many. I still feel like Max Gunn, Max Gunn is winning the rounds, but... Oh, dude. Oh, there we go, though. We buckle him. And I can't seem to land. Good shot there from Tyson. Got to be composed here. I don't want to get caught. Oh, there we go. There we go. Defense from Tyson lets him down. And Max Gunn drops him again. What a fight. What a fight. A rematch is in order. No matter what happens here. A rematch is in order. And Tyson can't beat the count. Max Gunn does it again. Takes out Iron Mike. Wow. He is now a champion in the heavyweight division. Wow. Iron Mike Tyson is knocked out. Max Gunn does it again. Championship heart. 27-0. Wow, dude. What a fight. What a fight. Tyson was a killer coming in there. Landing so many shots. I feel like Max Gunn may have some injuries after that. But I guess we will see. We now need to give Michael Schmidt a title shot. And he is 25-7. and seven. He is a conventional fighter as well. I feel like Max Gunn will make short work of this dude, but we'll see how it goes. A very tough fight for Max Gunn, though. A very, very tough fight. How on earth was that even a thing, dude? That guy, he ate so many shots. I've got to give credit to Max Gunn. He ate so many punches and just kept going, and he managed to get the uh, he managed to get a victory. And we haven't got any kind of injuries from that fight. I thought we'd have had so many, man. We was getting slammed by Mike Tyson. But there you go. It is what it is. We're going to get into the next fight and hopefully get into another win. Let's see it, man. Let's go. Here we go again, man. So this is the first title defense in the heavyweight division. Now, there has been a verbal agreement by Mike Tyson and Max Gunn for another fight. Tyson being 27, Max Gunn being 26. They're very much the same age. And I guess we're, uh, we'll see that again down the road. They're definitely going to fight again. There's no doubt about it. Okay, here we go. So this is Smith. This is another fighter. He's very awkward, very unconventional. Can we get a big win here and take this man out on our first defense? We have yet to find out, but so far, definitely so good. Max Gunn landed flush. Big shots landing here. Okay. Oh. Whipping in them shots. Smith not really throwing back. Max Gunn being the aggressor here early. Got some very tight defense. And he's a big, tall, rangy guy too. Max Gunn just moving around the shots. He can see the openings very well. He's got very good angles. Max Gunn, he moves well. Likes his angles. Big straight there, but he did land the jab back. And this dude wants to be aggressive. We're going to bite down on the mouthpiece and fire back. We're going to take it back to him. There it is. Let's see how this goes though. Max Gunn looks like a small fighter in the heavyweight division. He, like when he was uh, when he was a light heavyweight, he was a big boy. But now he's up here, he looks pretty small compared to some of these guys. Big straight there for Smith. And Max Gunn is eating these shots. We need to be careful. Another cut on the eye of Mad Max. Not good. There's blood all over the shoulder of Smith. Oh, and he's rocked though. Max Gunn drops him. What a fight, bro. These few episodes in heavyweight have been absolutely crazy. Smith goes down. And there we go. Back up. 
putting it all together well. Mad Max doing it again. Just got to watch that cut. Nice head movement there from Schmidt getting himself out of trouble. Good shot to the body there from Max Gunn though. Uppercut lands flush. Oh, big shot for Schmidt now. Who's bombing it on, but it is too late. Into the next round. Round number two. And that's straight. He, got, he does remind me of, like, Klitschko, this dude. His punch style, the way he moves, he throws a lot of straights. Getting flush there. Max Gun, three, four punches there, landed in that combo. Beautiful. Waiting on him. There it is. Okay. Turn him, land a big left. There we go. Max Gunn, he's faced some very, very big adversity since being heavyweight. Obviously, the Morrison fight was a catchweight, so he was still technically a light heavyweight. Two fights in the heavyweight division, one against Tyson and Smith. Both guys have cut him, and both guys are landing at a better rate. I feel like it might be the size difference, the weight difference, I don't know. But Mad Max is not the same fighter as he was in light heavyweight. He's probably a lesser version. I don't know if it's because he needs to put on the extra pounds. He's still knocking guys out as we see the Tyson fight, but I don't know. It's a little bit more difficult for Mad Max, especially fighting a giant like this dude. I'd like to make a giant dude, you know, one day. I feel like that would be very interesting. You know, having all that size and being able to be like a Klitschko kind of fighter, using very good jabs and straights. Like Max Gunn, he's having to bite down here, slip some punches and come back with some of his own. And this dude is very tough. Very tough to fight. This is no joke, man. This dude's a beast. The jab. Sticking him with the jab, though. Nice roll shot there. That was nice. Sort of rolling and waiting for the timing to the opening. Okay. There it is again. Really just trying to open up. Whenever that dude has an opening, we're trying to just throw bombs and try and drop him. That is what we're trying to do. So far, we've dropped him once. Can we do it again? These boys are going punch for punch. I feel like that might be a bad strategy for Max Gunn. Punch for punch against this guy. He's uh, very strong, very rangy. He's starting to land a little bit more now. Oh, good shot from Max. Got to jump on it, got to capitalize. Smith goes down. And that could be it. Mad Max throwing bombs, trying to get him out of there. He's getting up. I, I can already tell he's getting up. He's taking his time. He's getting back up to his feet. Let's go. Swift right hand there. Beautiful right hand from Mad Max. Okay, waiting on him. Again, waiting on the openings there. I'm trying to counter him now. I'm not trying to aggress him. Uh, because I feel like that is when this dude fights a little bit better. Mad Max though counters him again. And Schmidt is down for the third time in a fight. Again, the strategy is starting to work. Straight right, left hand. And then a little uppercut on the way down. Crack Smith. Puts him down and potentially out of this fight. Smith down again. Can he beat the count for a third time? We're going to find out. He looks wobbly. He's done. Mad Max still undefeated as a heavyweight. Still undefeated in general. He does it again. Takes out another young challenger. And Mad Max still undefeated. 20, what is that? 27-0 or 28-0? I have no idea. I think that's 28-0. I believe. I think. I don't really know. <laughs> Another big win. Defending our first belt in the heavyweight division. We won off Mike Tyson. A tough fight. Again, we see Mad Max cut. We see him cracked. But this dude has got a chin. Let's be honest about this. He's never been knocked down in his career. In 20, yeah, 28 professional fights, this dude has never been dropped. You have a serious injury. Now, this is where things start to get a little bit of a problem. We've got some internal bleeding. We're definitely going to clear that up, obviously. <laughs> uh, okay, right. Let's see who they offer us. Because now, after the title defense, we now get to choose who we fight next. And we've got some guys here that I, I think are deserving of a fight. And you know there's one man. There's one man that we need. I think, I think that fight on our record is something else. We just beat Smith. We beat Mike Tyson. The three champions of the division are Julius Shelton... Uh, Braden Phillips and Max Gunn. I feel like 
it's, there's only one option here. I feel like there's only one option. Let me know down in the comments below. But I feel like Muhammad Ali is the next fight. I feel like that is definitely a fight. 62 and 9. The, the greatest of all time needs to share the ring with Max Gunn. And, and uh, can he do it? I, I, I think Muhammad Ali could definitely beat Max Gunn. He's got the range. He's got a absolute granite chin. And uh, he's definitely got some power in there as well that could take Max Gunn out. He, he's a very slick boxer. I feel like Muhammad Ali could be the man to beat Max Gunn or Mike Tyson. It's going to be one of them too, I believe. But uh, we'll see. We'll see what happens. But for today's episode, guys, I'm going to end it here. I think the next fight is Muhammad Ali. But if you guys want any other fight, let me know. I believe... Can I actually see... I, I want to see how old he is. I don't know if we can see that. I don't think we can. Compare fighters. Here we go. So Muhammad Ali. I don't think... Yeah, it's not saying age there, I don't think. Uh, but wins. Look at that, man. That is just a crazy, crazy fighter that we definitely need to fight. It doesn't matter... I think that fight is... That's a huge fight. Anyway, guys, I'm going to end it here, though. Thank you so much for watching. If you have enjoyed it, smash the like button. Comment and subscribe, and I will see you for more Fight Night Champion next time. Stelton, guys, have a wonderful day, and I will see you all again in the next video.